U.S. Special Forces and Secret Service agents are now in Northern Ireland ahead of the visit of President Barack Obama for the G8 summit in just over a week. Helicopters and armoured vehicles are expected to arrive soon and it's understood a detachment of U.S. Marines will be here. Whatever the short-term economic benefit of the world leaders in County Fermanagh, the area needs long-term jobs and businesses to grow and that was the focus of a conference in Enniskillen today. Our Southwest reporter Julian Fowler was there. Spending a hot sunny day inside a college talking about economics wouldn't be everyone's top destination. But the message of this conference was that the Southwest region is a potential destination for international business and the G8 presents a unique opportunity. In terms of building people's confidence and, and, and kind of capitalizing on their capability and I think this has the potential, the same way the Titanic year, the, the year of culture in Derry and here the G8 in Fermanagh, I think these are all potential game changers. I think it's what we make of it. If we decide we want to use this to help build and reshape the economy, we can do so accordingly. Having the confidence to sell the advantages of doing business here is key to attracting inward investors. An international legal firm that now employs 300 people in Belfast says the G8 will help to get that message across. It will put a spotlight onto what we found as part of our global search to establish our office in Belfast, that it's a region that's rich in talent, um, great can-do attitude and a, a great place to do you know, business. For local students who will soon be looking for jobs, creating new opportunities will be key to their futures. I was at a youth summit there last month and no one else in the UK is going to have that there to put in a CV for a university and it's going to generate a lot of money for the local economy as well, all those people coming over to the G8. After a day talking about the economy, a well-deserved treat, some Fermanagh ice cream. Julian Fowler, BBC Newsline, Enniskillen.